are you doing here? Uh, Come on. Uh, I'm, an, I'm an American. <laughs> My name is Leviticus Cornwall. ¿Quién es este hombre? No lo había visto antes. Me estaba siguiendo en el bosque. Un tipo raro. Okay. I don't know. Uh, maybe there's still time to get to the other workers. Uh, oh yeah. Uh, I think I hear voices coming from the other ruins down there. Let's sneak down and take a look. Which way? I'll show you. Baptiste, you don't look good. You should rest here. Okay. You'll need this. Come, follow me. Stay close behind me. I know a way we can sneak around. Okay. Keep quiet and don't kill anyone. If they catch us, they'll murder the workers for sure. Who was that, sir? Shh. One of her accused men. Quick. Hide. Over there. Okay, te voy a decir una cosa. Mi abuelo siempre dijo que la Guarma era la isla de la que Dios se había olvidado. Y después de estar aquí un mes, entiendo a lo que se refería. No hay nada aquí. Hay que regresar. Tan solo tres meses más y a casa. Por favor. Come on, follow me. Careful. Another one. Hide, quick. Fue creado por ratas. ¿Ratas? Creado por el mismo diablo. ¿Qué tal va todo para allá? Ya casi acabo. ¿Saben? Por mucho que disfruto viendo un socialista colgando, ahorcar es un trabajo tedioso. ¿eh? Toma demasiado tiempo. Estás enfermo. Toca ver cómo sigan los prisioneros. A ver si el gringo ya abrió la boca. Claro que abrió la boca. Siempre lo hacen. Come on, stick tight. <laughs> yes. Maldito bastardo! Son of a bitch. Get them down from there. Shoot the ropes.
coming from behind us. Thank you, my friend. I'm Baptiste. I work with Hercule. We owe you our lives. Yes. Thank you. My pleasure. This place makes me miss home. Take care, my friend. Hercule is getting a boat lined up to get you and your men out of here. Just meet him at Cinco Torres. We'll be there. Good, good. Here, this is for you. Thanks. It's not much, but it's the least we can do. Good luck getting home. Hey. Hey. So, uh, what's the plan? Well, I found the cave Hercule spoke of and also a guide. She's up ahead. I think we can trust her. Follow me. The entrance is along here. Just watch your footing. So, uh, what do we do when we get Javier? Well, uh, gonna get the hell out of here. Man, set sail for the one place. Ain't nobody gonna be expecting us. Uh, uh, get everybody together uh, and get ourselves back on course. Where would that be? Place we just escaped from. <laughs> You want to go back to Sandiné? If it was you got left, you'd want us to go back. I'd want it, but I wouldn't expect That's it. That's the point. Ain't no one gonna expect it. We come back from the dead, gather everyone, and we leave before anyone realizes we've even resurrected. An insect bite you or something? Cause you gone, friend. We look like what we are. A bunch of desperados on the run. But with the women, a change of clothes, we're a choir, or a gang of pilgrims, or something. Whatever you say. We're a bunch of penniless fugitives on some Caribbean dump, sneaking through caves while two of our best men got shot back home. How could I doubt you, Dutch? You got no idea, Arthur. No idea at all. I will do whatever it takes for us to survive. I guess that's what I'm afraid of. Hold on. Why? Gloria! Ay, estás tarde. Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Dinero, the money, the gold. Aquí. Dámelo. Oh, it's genuine, you old hag. <gasps> Vamos, vamos, rápido. Now that gold right there, that's the last bit of gold I have in my pocket from the bank. The rest of it is at the bottom of the sea. Exactly. <sighs> you know, wasn't Fusar one of the fellas Bronte pointed out to us? At the party in Saint-Denis? Yeah. 
You're right. I knew I'd heard that name before. Uh. So, I met up with Leon. That situation with the workers is dealt with. Captured, tied up, beaten. Poor bastards. No, that was me. Are you sure this her Q fellers ain't just using us? Almost certainly. But he's the best chance we have right now of getting out of this place. Won't be long before someone figures out who we are and sends word to the U.S. So what happened with John and that bank? He survived. Unlike dear Hosea and Lenny. The only one they took alive. Why is that, you think? I don't know. I was already on the roof. I didn't see it. And Abigail, I presume she was able to slip away in time. What are you talking about? You know, when I look back at all the chaos of the past few weeks, the apparent superficial chaos, I begin to wonder, maybe, for somebody, this is all going exactly to plan. I still ain't sure what you're saying, Dutch. Puede callarse ya. Estamos cerca. The door is stopped. You'll have to lift it. Pardon me, my queen. <coughs> Arthur, come help me with this. Just lift it. Okay, then. <coughs> oh, that's it. This way. See, si. then you pay more. Okay. More. Just a second. Pay more. Pay now. What? What are you doing? Ah, Jesus. Easy, ah. Dutch. What was that? Horrible old crone. But you killed her. She was going to betray us, Arthur. Couldn't you tell? No. Well, I got some Spanish. She was. You keep killing folk, Dutch. I am just trying to make sure that some of us survive, Arthur. Now, shall we proceed? I guess. Listen, <clears throat> son. You think I want any of this? I don't know. Of course I don't. But I made a pledge to you all. We would survive. No matter what. So how did you know she was going to betray us? What'd she say? It was in her eyes, in the way she was leading us. But you said you knew Spanish. I know human beings. Arthur. <laughs> Are you going to strangle me next? I'm doing the best I can. I come from Mexico. I never met those men. Does anyone believe him? Oh. Mr. Simon doesn't believe you. Even the mule doesn't believe you. Eso ni fue para tanto. Si que deja de actuar. Sabemos que no estuvo tan fuerte. Fue bastante duro. No. La próxima vez será aún más duro. Bueno. Ha sido un placer. Siempre me encantaron los mexicanos. Vamos, carajos. They're all listening to that fool. They won't notice us if we stay quiet. We need to deal with them. Well, I'm sure you got some ideas. Shut up and help me kill them. On my count, you take the one on the right. I'll take the left. Okay. 
Let's hide the bodies. You grab that one. Over here. Let's head around the back of the building and see if we can find a way through. ourselves a little distraction and then poof we will disappear take the other side of this door Escondí una botella. Voy a buscarla. Gracias. Okay. You take the nearest one on the left. I'll deal with his friend. Es una mierda. Es lo más bajo de una civilización. Over here. Okay, now we need to create a diversion. Uh, what do you think? Find another old lady to strangle? That is enough, Arthur. This is a war. Well, if this is a war, then we need to start blowing some stuff <laughs> up. <laughs> exactly. Is there any dynamite? Oh, no, we don't need dynamite. We got a furnace and lots of sugar. Sugar? Oh, yeah. <laughs> no problem. You'll see. <laughs> Go close the windows and the doors. Go on, quick. <laughs> There is enough dust. This place is cold. Get this going. We'd better hurry. Follow me. Okay. to that building when it goes up. Come on, we can hide behind that well. That place has to blow soon. Get ready to make a run for Javier.
Take care of these fools a bit. No problem. Go quick. This will give us a chance to get the We did what you asked. It's like I said. Fusar knows who you are and knows the price on your head. It's a big problem. Uh, I see. But if we can silence him, then I can help you escape before anyone has time to get here from America. That way, we all get what we want. We want to get the boat you promised us. And you will. But you have found yourself in the middle of a war, my friend. Fuso has called in the Navy from Cuba. There's no way a boat could live right now. Hercule! Hercule, s'il vous plaît! Vite! Vite! Come. Follow me. Quick! So now we have a real problem. This must be the boat he called in from Cuba. 
That's a goddamn warship. You kinda have to hand it to this fella. So I guess great minds think alike. So what now? We fight all we want. Any of you boys feel like running? So what do we do? I will go get the cannon ready. Okay, let's get to it. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of guns out there. So, what do we do? I say we push forward, because if we don't, we're gonna die here and now. Okay, then. Follow me. This is kind of fun. from both sides. Damn it! What do we do now? I think I got a plan. You cover the left side. Okay.
Between the two of us must go and use the cannon. You go, Arthur. I'll gladly hold him off this beach a while longer. You sure? Just certain, son. I'll find it. You think that cannon will be enough? Only one way to find out. Christ sake, how many men is Hussar got? That's the problem. It doesn't matter how many we kill, he will have the money to get more. Watch out! We need to put a serious hole in that boat. down from here. Come on. That was quite some shooting, boys. Thank you. What now? Oh, they'll be back. But I found a boat for you. And he should be arriving on the dock any time now. Great. Micah, go meet with the captain. If he's amenable and discreet, tell him we'll be ready to set sail soon. Bill, come help me collect poor old Javier. Sure. And cool. It was a great pleasure to make your acquaintance. I thought I was dead for sure. Hi, boys. We got a real problem. Nice Mr. Fusar don't want us going nowhere. He knows just who we are. If he can keep us here for a few more days, well... And what about the captain of the ship here? They got him trussed up like a hog. Guards all over the place. Got us surrounded with gun positions, so when we try to sail out, he's gonna blow holes in us. This fella is really beginning to try my patience. He ain't even had you tortured yet. <laughs> I like the man's style. He's thorough, nasty, and vindictive. In this instance, I don't see we got any alternative, but we go and free our friendly captain and destroy the artillery. For once, I agree with you. Fair cool? Oh, I'll fight Alberto Fusa every day I can. All right. Bill, you're gonna guard Javier on the ship here. Micah, Arthur, let's get to work. Fair cool? We follow you. Hanale, this way. Quick, let's get up around the back of that artillery post.
You got it secured properly, cowpoke? I think so. Knowing you, I have my doubts. Shut up, my kid. <laughs> Come on, run! I got you now, you bastard. We are all bastards, my friend. But only one of us is some would-be emperor's whore. We know who you are. And nobody knows who you are. Not even your goddamn father. You maggots are going to die. Eventually, I'm sure we will. But not today, and not because of you. The U.S. Navy is on the way. I am sure they are, which is why you're going to let us leave. Or you are dying right here, my friend. We've killed better men than you fools. Enough? Oh, I've had enough of this. Arthur, the rifle? Sure. Are you men gonna give up? Let us leave? 
Are you gonna die? Put your guns down. You saved my life. Thank you, Captain. I suppose you men are my cargo. Dutch Vanderlyn, I am sorry you got hurt. Captain Sam... Let's go. Gentlemen! Up there, I think. In the tower? Yes. Yes, that's him. This goddamn idiot. Come on! He's shooting. We have to take him down. Out there. There's another cannon up ahead on our left. Can you get to that? I'll try. Here. Captain, can you handle the ship? I'll be fine. Come on. We'll get going with the tide before I get any more surprise interviews with local officials. Are you gonna be okay? We'll be like you. We'll disappear probably. Back to IT. Believe me. We'll be long gone by morning. Good. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> We survived. Just about. What now? What now? What do you mean, what now? I mean, we're headed back to Lemoyne again, and we're all wanted men. <laughs> we slip ashore one by one, find out what's what. We don't cut and run now. Head back to Blackwater. No. Why not? Because the last thing they'll be thinking is for us to turn up. We've been on the run for a while now, and it feels like, like our luck has turned. You know? And I ain't turning back. We had a good run of it, I guess. We ain't even played our hand yet. We just need to put some more money in our pockets. Make our escape. Broke, alone, they're gonna pick us off one by one. And you know it. Maybe. Not. Maybe. We need to split up. Keep a low profile. Try to track down the rest. But carefully. See if they send any mail. Arthur, 
You check Shady Bell. We'll find each other eventually. We always do. And then what? Then we meet up. We gather the family, we get some money, and get the hell out of there. That's the plan. We all acting crazy. And uh, that's not what I thought we were going to be doing here. We have here. been in a bad way. Listen. I will kill for my family. Any of you want to judge me for that? That's fine. But that is who I am. Anyone disagree? Anyone? <laughs>